Hi guys, so today I have another Knit Crate unboxing and it doesn't look quite the way it usually does and I think that a big portion of that has to do with the fact that Knit Crate is based out of Miami and right now Irma is headed towards there so they've had to kind of rearrange a few things um, but I'm still really excited to get into here but before we do that I did want to quick show you what I made last month so last month they had this sugar bush chill yarn in uh, two colorways one was Mountie Mango and I don't remember what the other one was this is of course Mountie Mango and um, I made up this shawl from um, Crin Wilon? I don't know how to say that last name at all. Um, but yeah, it's a big chunky knit shawl and I have so much hair that this can be a little difficult for me to get on. So bear with me a second. But yeah, I really actually like it a lot. I was a little worried just because chunky knits are not typically my cup of tea. But yeah, I really do like it a lot. So yeah, and it'll keep my neck nice and warm during these cold Minnesota winters. But yeah, I really liked it. So let's get into what is in this knit crate. So like I said, this is my birthday month, so I'm hoping that it'll be kind of more up my alley. I love that knit crate does all sorts of different things like neons and um, pastels, this kind of... I don't know what you'd call this. It's kind of like a bright, but I don't know. I don't know what you'd call it. It's not neon, but anyway, very pretty. Regardless, <laughs> I do have a very specific color palette that I like to play with. And so cross your fingers. So let's grab the card here. Uh, the theme for this month is couture. Oh, and this is the artisan crate. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. So this is their main crate. And yeah, uh, their theme is couture and it says bespoke garments made by hand are a true luxury. In this month's Knit Crate shipments, experience an array of meticulously beautiful dyed yarns designed to entice and enhance our theme couture. So the yarn is from Lorna's Laces and oh fun, this is in their uh, lookbook yarn and the colorway is Haymarket or is it their Haymarket yarn? In the colorway lookbook. It's their Haymarket yarn in the colorway lookbook. And so this is the yarn. It's definitely more up my alley than a lot of these. So it's got some of that dark purple that I kind of tend to gravitate towards. Lots of muted tones here. This is definitely something that I would probably pick up myself. Very, very soft. And I kind of like that it's not a super shiny yarn. Um, I kind of like the more matte tones, I guess. So yeah, I'm going to have so much fun with this yarn. So let's see, it is 100% blue faced. I don't know how to say this. Lessis, less, oh, I can't say it, but it's wool. <laughs> and there are 215, 215 yards per 100 grams on, yeah. Really like that. And so let's see what the pattern is. This one is by Christine Marie Chen. They're both by, okay. Um, and so the beginner pattern is the Westgate Cowl. That's really quite pretty. And then the intermediate advanced design is Rocky Canyon Cowl. And that looks fun. It looks like there are a lot of slip stitches in there. I'm not sure how well you're gonna be able to see it. But if you want to see it, you know, completely knit up, definitely come back to my channel and see next month's unboxing and I'll have it all made up and everything. I really like to do that. Um, and then there is always an extra in here. So let's see what the extra, oh, cute. It's a little um, picture holder. And this is from Clever Critter. And it says, someone really loves you. <laughs> Isn't that cute? I love that. Um, I can definitely get a picture of Evelyn and put it on my desk at work. I will really like that. Okay, so uh, there is one other thing in here and that is the card for their butterfly boxes. And so this really helps uh, people give back to the community. And so the this particular year is for refugees. 
So this month, it says cold weather will be here before we know it. You can keep newly arrived refugees' hands warm with mitts, mittens, and gloves. And I actually, I don't know if you guys know this, um, one of my favorite things to knit up are mittens. So I might, uh, I might try and get some of these out for um, the butterfly boxes. So anyway, that is my knit crate for this month. I'm so excited about it. This is just gorgeous, gorgeous yarn. I'm really excited to dig into that and start knitting. So yeah, um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you did, certainly give it a thumbs up. And if this is your first time on my channel, definitely hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications if you'd like to see more. Um, but as for right now, I think I'm going to get going and get, uh, get knitting on this. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!